Ford. Number three, Ben Byer. Number four, Charlie Ballou. Ramon, 41, 
Sam Baker. 42, Jameson Wong. 43, Chris Clothman. 44, Leo Medina Lopez. Number 45, Aiden Freeman. 46, Ethan Adridge. 49, Chris Kiley. And 50, Jameson Kahn. And this is the men's coaching staff. Head coach, Tommy Pierce. And assistant coach, Torin Barnes. Ladies and gentlemen, could you please rise as gentlemen remove your caps as we honor America. Welcome inside the Virginia Beach Sports Complex. I'm Nick Kinn, excited to spend the next two hours with you calling some D3 men's lacrosse. We got one heck of a matchup today between the Wooster Fighting Scots, who are 5-1 and one on the year, taking on the Ithaca Bombers, who are 3-2. and two. This game will come down to one thing and one thing only, the face-off X. Both squads are in the top 50% in D3 lacrosse and face-off percentage. So Chris Soule and Chase Gullick of Ithaca versus Jimmy Fisher and Rory Zarin of Wooster will have a heck of a battle going forward in this game. Today's game between Ithaca and Wooster is brought to you by the Drip Bar. The Drip Bar, specializing in IV vitamin therapy. Both squads getting ready to take the field here. Ithaca in white, Wooster in the navy blue, the dark royal blue. with the flyovers today. That's what happens when you come down to the south of Virginia Beach. Both teams very used to the cold weather. We have a warm day here, hot and humid. Pushing 70 degrees, should be 74 by the, by the time the, the game concludes, excuse me. Wooster, of course, coming off their best season in program history. 13 wins, they're starting off hot. Have most of their starters returning. Only one first year starter. Ithaca, on the other hand, lost a lot of first year starters. Have eight. New players starting off this face-off. About to get started here. And Ithaca takes the first face-off. Turned over quickly, Wooster with possession. Henry McMahon with the ball. Over to Rory Zarin. Zarin, a junior, primarily a face-off specialist, but also does play the midfield. He'll peel back. Wooster making some substitutions here. Byers with the ball. Or excuse me, that's, that's Jord. Now Byers. High pass, reeled in by Wooster. Shot clock down to 36. Great defense by Ithaca, playing the spacing extremely well. Luke Budd with it. He'll pass it out. 
Fink shoots and a miss that'll be a retained possession for Wooster. Shot clock still at 13. Byers. And he'll overthrow that. Ithaca's ball. One turnover each for both squad early. Cole Corgan is in goal for the Bombers. He has started every single game in the net for the squad. And then grad student Paul Chandler in the goal for the Fighting Scots. Kyle Proctor with it. The Bombers will reset. Pass inside. And an Aaron shot. Ithaca will retain possession. John Sramak with the ball, the team's leading scorer for the past two seasons. Mishandled there by Ithaca. Senior Charlie Niebuhr with the errant stick work and Wooster will take possession. Seth Owens gets checked. The defenseman obviously not used to carrying the ball like that. And another clear by Ithaca. Ithaca has an over 90% clear percentage. That is top 10 in D3 lacrosse. Scoreless first three minutes here in Virginia Beach. Proctor with the ball. Beautiful spin move. He'll dish it inside. Shot and score. Ithaca strikes first. Brady Graham with the shot. His eighth goal of the season. Ithaca takes a 1-0 lead. So an Aaron turnover by Wooster turns into an Ithaca score. The Bombers up one. Ithaca win their second faceoff of the day. Commanding the X so far. And they're back on the offensive possession. Proctor slowing it down. Ithaca taking their time here. Balls with Sam Baker. He's a sophomore. He's appeared in all five games this year. We'll roll the crease. Dish it off to Niebuhr. Niebuhr across the field, back to Baker. Baker behind the net to Proctor. And we have our first call of the game. Wooster will take over. And they'll move it fast. The Scots, striking distance here. And they strike indeed. Goal for Wooster. That's Vinny DeLeo. Evened up here early on in the first. The Leo, a veteran, obviously, of this Wooster squad. Honorable mention, all NCAC selection in 2022. Became a two-time NCAC honor last season. And Ithaca with another face-off win here. Proctor inside and stuffed. John Sremak, the team's leading scorer. Stuffed right outside the crease. Wooster powering through the bomber defense. And saved there by Cole Corrigan. Yeah. 
Ithaca will peel off, slow things down a bit. Ibrahima with the ball. Proctor once again carrying it behind the net. Oh, and he'll fake a roll the crease, then actually make it. That's back to Pastor. Still with possession here. A nice spin move, great defense by the Scots. And there's Sremak and a goal. Kyle Proctor, a beautiful assist there. What a play by the Bombers. They, they take the lead once again, 2-1. Early on in the first, five minutes of race so far. John Sremak with the assist, he leads the team with now nine. Addition it to Kyle Proctor, the junior. That's Proctor's fourth goal of the season. Ithaca has won all three face-offs so far, looking to make it four here. As I mentioned earlier, both teams above 60% on the year in face-off win percentage. And we have a false start, and Wooster will get their first face-off win via a penalty. Lane Kellogg with the ball. He leads the team in points with 28. Shane Epstein Petrullo with the ball. He'll drive to his right, dishes it, and a rocket. And Wooster will retain possession on the Aaron shot. Fires with it. We'll get rid of it quickly. Jojo Jordan with the ball now. Dishes it back to Kellogg. Little slip there. Nonetheless, he keeps his composure. Behind the net to Byers. Ithaca's defense has been stifling so far. A jump shot miss. Wooster will have it back. Byers has it stripped. Ithaca ball. And they'll clear it. Or will they? Low pass there back to Corgan. The grad student. Transfer and an Aaron pass there by Ithaca. Wooster ball. Shellman with the ball. Awful lot of shouting down there. Jordan with it. Jordan will run to his left. Jared Borkin, Jared Borkin on him, excuse me. Byers commanding the offense. There goes Jord. Missed shot. And Wooster closest to it. They'll take the ball. Corgan will hustle back in goal. Wooster with 25 on the shot clock. Down 2-1 here. Byers, that's Kellogg with it, commanding the ground ball. He'll dish it out fast to his left. And a loose ball there again by Wooster. Another turnover here. Both teams a little sloppy early on. Ithaca with a successful clear this time. He'll pass over the middle. That's Ethan Flanagan. Now back to Proctor. Proctor to Jamison Juan here.
excuse me, Sam Baker. Kyle Proctor now. Back to Baker. Another great defensive possession for Wooster. Hoping to finish this one out though. 20 seconds on the shot clock here for the Bombers. That's Niebuhr with the ball. Wide pass, shot. It'll bounce over the goalie. Ithaca will retain possession with 13 seconds on the shot clock. Proctor rolls, 10 on the clock. Dishes it, Niebuhr. Oh, and a, what a shot. Or Baker, excuse me, Baker, what a shot. That's Baker's sixth goal of the year. The sophomore making an impact early. And we have a war here at the faceoff X. And Ithaca will win it again, yes. Wooster with one lone faceoff one coming off a penalty. Ithaca slowing things down here. Pastor with the ball. Gives it off to Ibrahima. Ibrahima, a long... And we're about to break out of the timeout here. Ithaca up 3-1. Three minutes left in the first quarter. You know, it's a hot day here in Virginia Beach. So make sure you stay hydrated with Gatorade. My personal favorite flavor, fruit punch. I'm an old school guy. Ithaca ball here with 28 seconds. They're up 3-1. John Stramack already making an impact. He has an assist, a beautiful one if of that. Dishing it to Kyle Proctor as he rolled the crease. Great ball moving from Ithaca. One guy that's been a little quiet, though, for Wooster, and I expect to see come up soon. Seth Owens, the defenseman. Wooster with it now. After an errant Ithaca possession. Ithaca? Giving number 66 Lane Kellogg a lot of space. He is the team's leading scorer. Leads him in both points, assists, and goals. Oh, and a slip there by an Ithaca defender for Corrigan who has been fantastic behind the net so far, saves another one. And another Aaron shot by Wooster. They will retain possession, though. Scotts needs to get something going here. A few empty possessions now. Jord has it. Ithaca, once again, great defense. And Corrigan, a brick wall back there. Not letting anything through. And this is, I think, a special to hear the clear. As I mentioned earlier, top 10 in the country. Over 90% on clear percentage. Wooster with the pressure. Slipping by Proctor. Oh, excuse me, that's not. By Flanagan, excuse me, he turns it over.
Ithaca sideline, frustrated at a no call. And the Scots will reset. Will Fink with it. He'll dish it to his left, that's Luke Budd. Budd will roll to his left, peel back. Hand it off to Kellogg. Wooster has been a team that has started hot this year. They're five and one on the year, coming off their best program season ever, 13 and four. Historic season, especially for Casey Steph and their defensemen. First got to be named an All-American since 2010. And he was the NCAAC Defensive Player of the Year. Quite the impact player, expect to see some out, something out of him as the game progresses. 10 seconds here for the, for the Scots, they have to get something going. Five, and they're in possession. Ground ball, and clock will expire. Ithaca will take possession. Another stout defensive possession for the Bombers. The first quarter will conclude. Ithaca ends it up 3-1. We'll be back right after this. Treat yourself to a visit to the Drip Bar IV Hydration and Vitamin Therapy in Virginia Beach. Boost your immunity, increase your energy, and promote anti-aging with our personalized treatments designed to ensure efficient nutrition absorption to rejuvenate your mind and body. Come see our chic and relaxing day spa for yourself today. We welcome walk-ins and appointments. Our medical professionals will help you achieve your best health and answer all your questions. The Drip Bar at Lansdowne Commons in Virginia Beach. Action D3 Ithaca up 3 1. End of the first quarter, second one about to start. The story of the game has been Ithaca's defense, letting in one goal, forcing several turnovers from the Fighting Scots. And of course, we have to talk about the offensive powerhouse for Ithaca, and that is John Sramak. He has been lights out for the Bombers for the past few seasons. First team all Midwest in high school in 2019, went to Mount Lebanon. He's from Pittsburgh. He was the 2021 Liberty League Rookie of the Year and the 2021 All-Liberty League Honorable Mention. He's netted over 35 points in all three of his seasons. He's on pace to reach that, to reach that mark again. And he, already has, he already has one assist today and he's definitely making an impact on the offensive side of the ball. The squads will switch sides here for the beginning of the second. Ithaca and White. Ithaca has been commanding the faceoff X thus far. Only one missed faceoff opportunity, and that came on a, a false move. And they will continue to corral the faceoffs. Another possession for Ithaca. And a great defensive check there. Unable to corral the ground ball is Ithaca. White's ball on a push. Look at Corgan, who has been a brick wall so far. We're letting one goal through. Ithaca now on the offensive attack once again. Slowing things down. Bombers making some substitutions here. Number 27, Colin Adams will dish it off. That's Sam Baker. He's netted a goal so far. Sramak behind the net to nobody else but to guess who? Kyle Proctor. Proctor's been active thus far. Quick sling, saved, but a foul. Ithaca will retain possession here, 60 seconds on the shot clock. 
Man up possession here. Proctor dishes it to his right. Quick pass. They think of sharing the wealth here. An Aaron pass there. Proctor looking to retain possession. He can corral the ground ball. Quick shot and score. Ithaca up 4-1. Charlie Niebuhr, the senior. Team leader in goals. Make that 14. Niebuhr now has 15 points on the year, 14 of which are goals. And we'll head back to the faceoff circle. And Ithaca wins again. Wooster getting dominated. Ithaca retaining these possessions and turning them into offense. Surprising start here for the Scots. They're top 25 in D3 lacrosse in, D3 lacrosse in points. And scoring offense. Held to only one goal. Ibrahima now. Beautiful spin. Errant pass. And the refs will rule that a pass. Wooster with the ball. The Scots need to get something going here. And the Ithaca bench making a heck of a lot of noise. They are excited. A big lead for the Bombers, and this would be a big win. Sitting one game above 500. Coach Tommy Pierce and his squad, loving the way this game is starting. And a quick score for Wooster, right on time. Lane Kellogg, who else? The team's leading scorer. That's his 19th goal in the year. He's one goal or assist shy of 30 points. And he makes it four to two. Another one, they say, yes indeed. No surprise there that Kellogg sparks the Wooster offense. Kellogg the sophomore out of Arvada, Colorado. He's a second year starter. Last year made a heck of an impact in Wooster's best season ever. Led the team with 32 assists and was second on the squad with 33 goals and 65 points. Right now he's in sole possession of the team Lead in both goals, assists, and points. As I said earlier, 29 on pace to cross that 65 mark. Finished fifth in the conference last year in assists. Looking to improve on that mark and help the Scots improve on their record. Shane Epstein Petrula with the ball. Vision out to his right. Wooster with another possession. Could be a big turn of the tables here. Speaking of turn, quick pass inside. Mishandled by Epstein Petrulo. Ithaca with possession. They're moving fast. Aaron pass. Corralled. Quick shot. And missed. And that should be Wooster ball it is. What a hustle there by Bill Holzer, the junior defenseman. And they are moving fast. The Scots not taking any time. Epstein Petrula looking to make up for that mistake. Quick side. Oh, and what a shot. Foul, though. Let's wait on the call. Goal is good. 4-3, Ithaca. Wooster with two quick scores. What a fantastic shot there by the Scots. Face off, and Wooster wins. Oh, 
call here if the Cobra retain possession. Wooster improving on the faceoff X. Ithaca looking to answer here. Two quick, two quick Scott scores. Almost five minutes raced here in the second quarter. Sramak with the ball. Proctor. Pass it outside. That's Colin Adams, who just got rid of it. Back to Baker, he's already scored. Can he do it again? Going to his right, he'll dish it quick. Back inside, errant pass. And ground ball here. And Wooster will take possession. They can equalize it here with 10 left in the second. They've got numbers. Great play there by the defenseman. That's number 19, P.J. Roth. Booster. They've got 40 on the shot clock. And Jord with it. He's been quiet, expect something out of him. Fink, and we have a whistle. Ithaca ball. And here come the Bombers. We'll make some substitutions. Here comes Ibrahima. Ibrahima, the junior. He started all five games. He's already noted five goals on the year and five assists. This is his first year starting out of Queens, New York. Standout at high school in Frederick Douglass Academy. He was named a standout freshman in the PSAL. And led the PSAL with 40 points and 38 assists as a sophomore, his high school district. Here he is right now. Ibrahima to his left, shot on goal. And it is tipped up and corralled by Wooster, but we have a whistle here. Ithaca, one of the least penalized teams in college across. Waiting for some clarification on the call here. And they will retain possession. 60 seconds on the clock. The Bombers started the game off extremely clean, which led to their three goal lead. Couple turnovers, led to Wooster scores, and now we're at 4-3. He'll dish it back to his left, shot on goal, and saved. Big save there by Paul Chandler, the senior goalkeeper. He crossed the 300 minute mark for this season already. Closing in on a 50% save percentage. He has started all six games for the Scots. Ithaca with the ball now. After an Aaron Wooster possession. Corrigan out to his right. And that is Jace Dox, the long stick midfielder, carrying it all the way through. He'll peel back. Ibrahima with it again. A near shot that was saved by Chandler. Oh, 
Stramak with it. He'll dish it quickly as he's doubled. No surprise, he is the team's leading in, leader in points. Proctor corrals it, has it stripped, ground ball, and that'll be a Wooster possession. Number eight, Casey Steffen corrals it. Wooster on the move. Casey Steffen, as I mentioned earlier, quite the impact player on defense. Sloppy few possessions. For a Wooster, they'll turn it over again. Looking to equalize it before the second quarter concludes. We're past the halfway mark, and we have a foul. They'll let the possession play out a little bit. Ibrahima. That's number 25, Jack Pastor. He has three goals early on this season. And turned over by the Bombers, and here will come the call. And the Bombers will retain possession. Couple mishandles here by the Wooster, by Wooster. Several turnovers, a couple penalties. They have played very well on the man up defense, however, stifling the Bombers. Ithaca scoreless throughout this period. Wooster clawing themselves back into it. They're pawing at the equalizing goal. While the Bombers are looking to explode with a two goal lead. Proctor, across the middle. A little duck and a shot and saved. Ground ball here, corralled by Ithaca. That's Charlie Niebuhr. Had a stick knocked out for a second, but Ithaca retains possession. Quick dish, errant pass. And Wooster with the ball. And we have Wooster with possession. Bullet pass. Over to number 42, that's Cooper Nichols. And we have a timeout. We're gonna step away. Treat yourself to a visit to the Drip Bar, IV hydration and vitamin therapy in Virginia Beach. Boost your immunity, increase your energy, and promote anti-aging with our personalized treatments designed to ensure efficient nutrition absorption to rejuvenate your mind and body. Come see our chic and relaxing day spa for yourself today. We welcome walk-ins and appointments. Our medical professionals will help you achieve your best health and answer all your questions. The Drip Bar at Lansdowne Commons in Virginia Beach. As a banker at Town Bank, we believe that people bank with people, not with banks. You're looking for an actual personal relationship, and that's what you get at our bank. You get that person that gets to know you, gets to know your business, is there for you. I think that is what motivates us, what drives us, and the idea that we are trying to serve others and enrich lives, I think is very true. It's everybody's favorite time of year again. Time to prepare to make your annual donation to that infernal revenue service. And if you're like me, you need help. Help to keep that donation as small as possible. So get off your W-2 and call John Maynard at John's Tax Service. 455-6763. Welcome back to the Virginia Beach Sportsplex for some D3 men's lacrosse. Between Ithaca and Wooster, I'm Nick King. Happy to be spending time with you on your Wednesday afternoon. It's a hot day here down south, and nothing better on a hot day than a sweet treat from Dairy Queen, where every day is sweet when you're eating ice cold blizzards. From m and to Oreos to Cookie Dough. My personal favorite chocolate fudge brownie, but I'm sure that does not matter. Coming out of the timeout, Ithaca trotting back on the field here. These guys obviously quite in shape, likely will not eat Dairy Queen. No AC where I'm at though, so I would not mind a ice cold milkshake.
Wooster with the ball looking for the equalizer. I made the wrong mistake wearing black today, I'll tell you that. Did not bring the proper fluids. The Scots have clawed their way back into it on a 2-0 run this quarter. Great defense and a great save. Who else but Cole Corrigan? Ithaca once again on the offensive possession and they're pushing and they're pushing fast. They'll slow it down. The Wooster bench getting louder as they can sense some vulnerability. Run them down, they say. Proctor not being run down. Having a hard time finding a teammate. And an errant pass by Proctor will turn to a Wooster possession. Wooster. Once again with possession, we've had a scoreless stretch here. Aaron pass. And Ithaca will pick up the ground ball. That's number 30, Eden Martin. The senior defenseman and lawn stick and the outfielder switches between the two. We'll give the Ithaca the, the Bombers the ball back. And here comes Niebuhr. He's already tallied a goal. The Bomber slowing things down once again. Niebuhr rolling the crease. And we have a call here. Timeout, Ithaca. We'll be back right after this, 44 seconds on the shot clock. Ithaca up. Pain and Gain, your one-stop shop for all things field hockey. Located in Princess One Shopping Center, Virginia Beach, we carry everything you need on the turf, from black sticks, turf shoes, mouth guards, and much more. Try out your stick before you buy in our synthetic turf area. Pain and Gain, embrace the pain, enjoy the gain. After more than 50 years of innovation, AstroTurf still leads the way. The inventor of artificial turf does it all, right here in the USA. We engineer, test, manufacture, and install the world's most innovative fibers and turf technologies with over 30,000 tracks and fields worldwide. AstroTurf, powered by Sport Group. Welcome back to the Virginia Beach Sportsplex. Nick Kane here, D3 men's lacrosse. Is Ithaca up 4-3. One heck of a game so far. And a second period commanded by defense. Two goals only, both by the Scots. Ibrahima now, will in the crease. The first year starter. Fighting his way through three defenders and he'll finally give up the ball and retain it. Ibrahim will finally pass it, that's Proctor. Proctor pump fake. And here comes the scene, the junior. Ibrahima, that's the second shot of the day. Second miss, but he's been active. Nine seconds on the shot clock for the Bombers. Seven, down to five. Sramak, quick roll, Aaron shot, and the shot clock will likely expire. Two seconds remaining. Ithaca will bring in their defensive lineup. Yeah. 
Niebuhr with it. To expire the last two seconds, and he'll throw it away. Ithaca will trot back on defense. A lot of noise being made. Ithaca getting excited. Quiet offensive half. There's Casey Steffen, as I mentioned. All NCAC honors last season. First time since 2010. But his son has been named an All-American. He's been locked down all season, and he's been locked down this period. Ithaca without a score throughout the second. A minute 30 left, 45 on the shot clock for the Scots. There's JoJo Jordan with it. Great name. He has it, knocked out for a brief moment. Will retain the possession. Dished off to DeLeo, or DeLeo. DeLeo has 15 goals on the year. He's the team's second leading scorer behind who else but Lane Kellogg. Ithaca, JoJo, and we have a call here. Ithaca, and we have a down Scott. That looks like number 22, Rory Zarin. Be met with the trainer here, walking off on his own. Looks like he's grabbing his hand. We'll hope he's okay. Both squads crapping it up for the injured, Scott. Zarin a junior, face off and mid face off specialist and midfielder. Zarin, second year starting, big loss. He went 113 for 190 on face offs and scooped 70, 67 ground balls for third on the team last year. And his near six face-off percentage was fifth in program history for a single season. It was good enough for fifth in the NCAC. This season, Zarin is 30 for 48 on face-offs. Wooster with possession here. And they will call timeout. 11 seconds left. And... The Woosters using their final timeout, looking for the equalizing score. It's been an entertaining first half here in Virginia Beach. Ithaca started off hot, started off hot with a three-goal lead going into the second, forcing several possessions on the Scots, but Wooster has clawed their way back into it, dug themselves into a little bit of a hole. They buried the bone, and now they're up two more scores down one. As we mentioned earlier, Rory Zarin just went out with a apparent hand injury. Big loss, primary facial specialist, and that's been the difference here in this second period. Early on, Ithaca corralled the faceoff X, winning all but one faceoff in the first quarter. Now, Wooster gaining some offensive possessions off rip, having to play less defense, letting the offense get into a rhythm, and you see the result. The defense feels well rested, letting up no goals. Casey Stefan has been a wall. But Cole Corgan on the, uh, the Ithaca side, despite the increased possessions for the Scots, has not let much through. He has been incredible back there. The fifth year grad student. Transfer, it's his first year here for the Bombers. And here come the squads trotting back onto the field. Eleven seconds here for Wooster. Looking to equalize it before the half ends. They've got five, they've got three. And they will end empty handed. The Bombers go up one goal over the Scots, who are 5-1 and one looking for an improved season record after a 13-4 year last year. We're going to step away, and we'll be back right after these messages. Treat yourself to a visit to the Drip Bar IV Hydration and Vitamin Therapy in Virginia Beach. Boost your immunity, increase your energy, and promote anti-aging with our personalized treatments designed to ensure efficient nutrition absorption to rejuvenate your mind and body. Come see our chic and relaxing day spa for yourself today. We welcome walk-ins and appointments. Our medical professionals will help you achieve your best health and answer all your questions. The Drip Bar at Lansdowne Commons in Virginia Beach.
As a banker at Town Bank, we believe that people bank with people, not with banks. You're looking for an actual personal relationship, and that's what you get at our bank. You get that person that gets to know you, gets to know your business, is there for you. I think that is what motivates us, what drives us, and the idea that we are trying to serve others and enrich lives, I think is very true. Well, it's everybody's favorite time of year again. Time to prepare to make your annual donation to that infernal revenue service. And if you're like me, you need help. Help to keep that donation as small as possible. So get off your W-2 and call John Maynard at John's Tax Service. 455-6763. Welcome back. Welcome back to the Virginia Beach Sportsplex. Nick Kane here. Halftime between the two squads, the Bombers and the Scots. Bombers up 4-3. And it has been an entertaining first half. Defensively oriented so far. Low scoring game. Wooster, a little bit unexpected. The Scots are in the top 25 in points in all of D3 men's lacrosse, but they've been stifled by an Ithaca defense who's been led by Cole Corgan. Corgan, obviously the fifth-year goalie. I've mentioned his name several times. Transfer, first year here in Ithaca, and he has been a wall. But another big key of the game, the face-offs. Ithaca, obviously... Winning a lot, majority of the faceoffs in the first half. Both teams came into the matchup above 60% on the year in faceoff win percentage. Ithaca corralled a lot in the first half, but Wooster's clawed their way back into it, corralling several faceoffs, say, say faceoff wins, excuse me, in the second half, in the second period, excuse me. The Bombers have had goals from John Schramack, or an assist from John Schramack, and goals from Sam Baker and Charlie Niebuhr and Kyle Proctor. Proctor, the junior. He's been absolutely fantastic this year, Offic uh, efficiently running the offense. He's from Briarcliff, New York, went to high school at Briarcliff, and he's a two-time sectional champion. He's a soft, uh, you know, when he was a sophomore and a senior, and he was all league his senior year. And his younger brother, Lucas, is also on the team. Lucas has appeared in one game so far. But John Stramack has been incredible as well. As I mentioned, he was the team's, he has been over 35 goals all his seasons here at Ithaca. Over 35 points, excuse me. Went to Mount Lebanon High School. Racked up quite the accolades while he was there. And then he has been a four-year starter here for the Bombers. And his stat line is rather impressive. Obviously a senior year looking to give Ithaca a spark as we enter the second half. They're up 4-3. He's already had quite the assist rolling to his left. Right over to Kyle Proctor. But expect a lot more out of Vinny DeLeo in the second half. He's from Trumbull, Connecticut. He's a, he's a Scott. He's played all four years. In 2021, he led, that, led the conference with 27 assists and tied for 45 points. And he's an honorable mention LNCAC selection 2022. And come 2023, he did it once again. We're going to step aside real fast. Halftime coverage will resume right after this. <laughs> As a banker at Town Bank, we believe that people bank with people, not with banks. You're looking for an actual personal relationship, and that's what you get at our bank. You get that person that gets to know you, gets to know your business, is there for you. I think that is what motivates us, what drives us, and the idea that we are trying to serve others and enrich lives, I think is very true. Well, it's everybody's favorite time of year again. Time to prepare to make your annual donation to that infernal revenue service. And if you're like me, you need help. Help to keep that donation as small as possible. So get off your W-2 and call John Maynard at John's Tax Service. 455-6763.
Pain and Gain, your one-stop shop for all things field hockey. Located in Princess One Shopping Center, Virginia Beach, we carry everything you need on the turf, from black sticks, turf shoes, mouth guards, and much more. Try out your stick before you buy in our synthetic turf area. Pain and Gain. Embrace the pain. Enjoy the game. Welcome back inside the Virginia Beach Sportsplex. Nick King here. Half time, four minutes left in the break. And these are some quite the athletes we're seeing here today. And if you want to get athletic, if you want to get your fitness on, try out One Life Fitness. One Life, one inspired life. We mentioned earlier the Face Off X, how it's been a key part of this game. Well, let's talk about two of the Face Off specialists for both teams. And I'm talking about Chase Gullick and Jimmy Fisher. Gullick, with the Bombers, has been quite the athlete his entire career. He's played four, year, he played four years varsity lacrosse at Darien High School in Connecticut. He won the state, the Class L State Championship in 2019, the FCIAC Championship in 2021, but that's not all. He was a running back and linebacker on the football team, and he was a four-season MVP, as well as an overall state champion on the Alpine skate, this Alpine ski team. So we have quite the athlete in one of the faceoff for one of the teams, the Bombers, Skiing. Quite the athlete. A lot of mountains up there in Ithaca. As they say, it is gorgeous. On the other hand, we have Jimmy Fisher. He's a veteran for the Wooster. For Wooster, excuse me. He ranked top 15 in D3 the cross and ground balls per game his freshman year. And he won a team leading 95 faceoffs and had 57 ground balls his sophomore year. And then last year, he continued to build on that with 98 ground balls for, for first on the team and third most in program history. And he had a .608 face-off percentage, the fourth best single season percentage in school history, and was good enough for fourth in the NCAC. I mean, we have two incredible face-off specialists, two incredible athletes going at it head-to-head. -head. Fisher, a little bit closer to home. He's from Granville, Ohio. And this has been quite the game so far. We're going to step aside one more time when we come back. Second half action. As a banker at Town Bank, we believe that people bank with people, not with banks. You're looking for an actual personal relationship, and that's what you get at our bank. You get that person that gets to know you, gets to know your business, is there for you. I think that is what motivates us, what drives us, and the idea that we are trying to serve others and enrich lives, I think is very true. Treat yourself to a visit to the Drip Bar IV Hydration and Vitamin Therapy in Virginia Beach. Boost your immunity, increase your energy, and promote anti-aging with our personalized treatments designed to ensure efficient nutrition absorption to rejuvenate your mind and body. Come see our chic and relaxing day spa for yourself today. We welcome walk-ins and appointments. Our medical professionals will help you achieve your best health and answer all your questions. The Drip Bar at Lansdowne Commons in Virginia Beach. After more than 50 years of innovation, AstroTurf still leads the way. The inventor of artificial turf does it all, right here in the USA. We engineer, test, manufacture, and install the world's most innovative fibers and turf technologies with over 30,000 tracks and fields worldwide. AstroTurf, powered by Sport Group. Welcome back inside the Virginia Beach Sportsplex. D3 men's lacrosse action between Ithaca and Wooster about to start up again. Today's game between the two squads is brought to you by Drip Bar. Drip Bar, specializing in IV vitamin therapy. We're about to begin second half action here. Nick King on the call. Ithaca up one goal, headed into the second half. And a false start move there by Ithaca. Wooster will take possession to start off the third quarter. Kellogg with the ball. He's already scored today. Wooster's done a very good job today. Both teams, 
of sharing the wealth, working that entire shot clock. A quick dish there. That's Ben Byers with the ball. He'll swing it out to his right to Will Fink. Fink over to DeLeo. Keep an eye out for him. And Cole Corgan, who else? Another save. What an outing for the grad student. Who else? He does it again. Corgan. Keeping Ithaca possession after possession. There's a save, though, from the Wooster goalkeeper, Paul Chandler. Kyle Proctor will handle it for Ithaca. 40 seconds on the shot, or 60 seconds on the shot clock, excuse me. Proctor reaches out for that pass. Ibrahima with it. He's been active. Yet to notch a score yet. Quick pass. And Shramak is right there to retain Ithaca, Ithaca possession. It would work great up here in the press box. Some Zoop Eatery. At Zoop Eatery, you can build the perfect boxed lunch. Chandler came out far from the goal there. And there may be an empty net decision here for Ithaca. And the and the, the Scots a clean turnover. A lot of contact. Nieber slow to get up. Now Wooster with the ball. And an errant pass will end the possession. Missed our opportunity for both squads. Ithaca with the empty net. Had the turnover. A lot of contact. No call. Ithaca has yet to score a goal since the end of the first since the end of the first quarter, excuse me. And that's in big part to Casey Steffen. The defenseman has been incredible. He's a senior. From Danville, California, long way from home. Ithaca looking to strike first in the second half. Quick dish. That's Niebuhr. And a goal. Ithaca ends the scoreless drought. Charlie Niebuhr, after the, after the turnover last position, makes up for it, puts the Bombers up too. And it's Niebuhr's second goal of the day. Make it 15 on the year for him. That is his specialty, if you are a fan of Ithaca men's lacrosse. <laughs> Ithaca with the ball. They have possession once again. Big goal for Niebuhr. He ends the Bombers' scoreless drought. Gives him a two-goal cushion. Four minutes into the third. Beautiful spin move by Jack Pastor. Turned over, though. Wooster with the ball. And Ibrahima... Misses the ground ball opportunity. Wooster will clear it. That's the number 99, Sutton Ursulo. Scramble for the ball. Ithaca now has it. Another quick possession for the Scots. Oh, and a turnover. They'll pass to the middle. Shot on goal and in. Corrigan left the net, went behind. Turnover by the Bombers. Turns to a Wooster goal. They're back within one.
What a sequence. A crucial mistake for the Bombers. Corgan, that's his first mistake of the day. And it necessarily wasn't even on him. Just an errant turnover by the Bombers. Unlucky spot. Was just late to getting back. Chandler will swing it out to his left. That's Wolf Fink with it. Fink slowing it down. Booster looking for the equalizer. They have not led today. They've been down as much as three. Ithaca has commanded the lead since so three minutes into the game. One tie. That was at 1-1. One, one. And a Wooster mishandle by Ben Byers. They'll retain possession. And, man, the Bombers are corralling Lane Kellogg. That's Austin Jord. He'll swing it out to his left. Little hole and Corgan. I mean, do I even have to mention how great he's playing? The grad student showing his experience on, as I mentioned, an underexperienced Ithaca team. Only, they have eight first-year starters, as opposed to Wooster, who has one. Several players returning from that 13-4 record squad for the, squad, for the Scots last year. But this young Ithaca team, an experienced Ithaca team, is outperforming Wooster thus far. Niebuhr, who has two on the day. He'll shake off the defender. That's Derek Stout. Dennis Raymack to Proctor. Proctor breaks to his right. Stout now. Ooh, a collision there, loose ball. Casey Steffen was on that. Who else? I had a great defensive possession for the veteran defenseman. He'll just swing it out to Chandler. That's over to Epstein Petrullo. Mishandle there. And Ithaca will take the ball. On a mishandle there by Chandler and Owens, two seniors. Lazy. An avoidable mistake right there for the Scots. Gives Ithaca an opportunity. And we've seen that a lot today from Wooster. Several turnovers, several errant penalties have cost the Scots possession, which has allowed the, the Bombers to stay in front. Proctor with it. And that'll be an Ithaca turnover. Ithaca, after the first quarter, has been playing sloppier and sloppier. As I said, they went scoreless in the second. So far, decent in the third. Mistake right there. Two big mistakes, that one, and of course the goal. Lane Kellogg, looking for the shot. The sophomore who has been quite the impact player. Big part of that 13-4 record last year. Wooster 5-1. The Scots are coached by Eric Seidman. Wooster, of course, in the North, North Coast Athletic Conference. Ithaca in the East Coast. And a shot behind the net. Wooster will retain possession. Byers with it. Over to Kellogg. 
He'll roll the crease, looking for the shot, and he has it! Tie game with six minutes left in the third. Lane Kellogg, who else? Make that number two on the day for Kellogg. He has reached the 30-point mark seven games into the season, and the seventh is not even done. Kellogg, the team's leading scorer, the sophomore. We talked about him all day. And he makes an impact. Tie game. And Wooster will have the ball back and take the lead here. Their first lead of the game. They smell it. Great defense possession there by Ithaca. But Wooster will retain it. A little slow things down. Watch out for number 66, Lane Kellogg. He already has two on the day, looking for the hat trick. Wooster on a two-game win streak heading into the day, making, looking to make it three. Ithaca has had an up-and-down season so far. Two wins, two losses, and then on the ninth, Another win, looking to make it two in a row. Kellogg, here he is. Looking for three, and saved. Corrigan, blocking the star for the Scots. Quick dish, there's Niebuhr. He has two on the day as well, looking for his third. He'll peel to his right, calling some substitutions here, and he'll make a quick spin move. Has a lane, will peel behind the crease, and now we'll roll it. Tripped up. No, and there's the call. Ithaca will retain possession. On the tripping. Niebuhr was visibly frustrated on a no call earlier this half. Or an empty net opportunity for the Bombers. A lot of contact there. Now Ithaca with another man up possession. Can they retake the lead here? Wooster has yet to have a lead in the game. A lot of noise being made from this Wooster bench. D up they say. Ithaca taking their time, high pass there, corralled. Shot, and Kyle Proctor, oh my goodness! On the assist from Brandon Okino. What a laser to the inside. That's Okino's first assist of the year, Kyle sec Proctor's second goal of the day. Ithaca takes the lead. What a shot, and what a pass too. Silences the Wooster bench. Have a heck of a game so far. Here's Kellogg. Big problem for Wooster is getting it past goalie, goalie, excuse me, goalie Cole Corrigan. Ithaca capitalized on the man down opportunity for Wooster, man up for them. Squads both even now. Another flyover. As I said, they are loving this matchup. I can't take my eyes away from it. Oh, and Corgan, another save that's tipped up. He'll restart the shot clock. And Wooster will retain possession. Three minutes left in the third. Will Fink with it. Up from there comes Kellogg. Kellogg bumps the shoulder. Aaron shot, but Wooster will retain possession. 
Bruin. Bruin Piani closest to it. He'll take it off. Luke Bud with it now. Quick pass to DeLeo. High! Over the head of Will Fink. Another Wooster turnover. Ithaca ball. Here comes Niebuhr and the Bombers. Two squads. We're playing on AstroTurf today. AstroTurf, the most realistic, sports specific performance, longest lasting durability, and sound player protection. AstroTurf. We have a whistle here. Ithaca up one, 60 seconds on the shot clock. Referees discussing. fans in the stands are getting rather annoyed. Having an issue with the shot clock. It's supposed to go to 43 seconds. An Aaron restart there. Everything is set up. And we can continue action. Ibrahim will start with it. Ithaca up one, two minutes left in the third. And a great defensive stand there by Wooster. That's number 42, Cooper Nichols. Whistle flag. And that's a foul on Ithaca. Wooster ball, the bench is going crazy. Can they tie it here with two minutes left in the third? Nick Kane on the call. Gamers presented by Drip Bar. Specializing in IV vitamin therapy. Raising the shot clock here all the way up to 80. Clock is fixed. And we can resume action. Wooster ball. Here comes Jord. Man up situation here for the Scots. Can they capitalize? Taking their time here. That's over to Fink. Back to DeLeo. Fink, DeLeo, trading. DeLeo, rocket saved. Cole Corrigan. Nothing deters the grad student. He's been here too long. Ooh, and a great colli collision there by DeLeo. Forces a loose ball, corralled by Ithaca. And a great, a clear there. Proctor mishandles it, but overtain possession on the left. Nobody around him. Ithaca slowing things down. Shot clock and game clock nearly even. 15 second difference. Here we go. There's Baker. Baker to Niebuhr. Niebuhr spins off, cuts back inside. Niebuhr saved. Saved by Chandler. Paul Chandler keeps it within one. Now Wooster pushing.
Charlie better get the ball to the back side. Coach is not happy about that. Here comes Kellogg. The sophomore. Shot. Missed. Ground by Wooster. Saved again. Another laser. And another save. But an Aaron clear. Four seconds. Three seconds. And the, ha and the quarter will end. The goal will now count Niebuhr with a laser after time expired. Fourth quarter action will resume right after this. At CHKD, sports medicine is more than just treating injuries. It's a whole team approach to caring for young athletes. With experienced physicians, surgeons, trainers, and rehab specialists here when kids and teens need them most. Our experts help young athletes prevent injuries too with advanced training and conditioning programs that keep them in the game safely. CHKD Sports Medicine, where kids are more than patients and we're more than a hospital. I grew up here. I know this town. I know the people here. More important, they know me. As a banker at Town Bank, we become part of the communities we serve. The people who bank with us, our members, know us. When you bank with Town Bank, you'll know your banker. You'll know you can reach us, and you'll know we're here for you. Welcome back. D3 men's lacrosse action. Nick King here at the lovely Virginia Beach Sports Complex. A tight matchup entering the fourth. Defensive matchup. Ithaca up 6-5 against Wooster. And right now the difference has been Cole Corrigan in the net. He has been the lone star of experience here. Fifth year grad student. He's the oldest member of the team. Transfer though. But man oh man has he been solid. Brick wall back there. Fantastic outing for the fifth year senior. Rainy season coming here in Virginia Beach and April showers bring May flowers. Make sure that you revitalize your property today or following the spring season with Shine Time Power Wash and Paint Professionals. Face off here to begin the fourth quarter. A war out there in the circle and it's corralled by Wooster. The Scots have not led today had even did twice at 1-1 and 5-5, but Ithaca scored shortly thereafter to retain, regain the lead and has not let it up since. Wooster came into this matchup 5-1, Ithaca 3-2. Wooster looking to improve on a record-breaking season last year where they tallied 13 wins, their best in program history. Only one first-year starter, a lot of experience for Wooster. Ithaca off to a little bit of a slower start this year. Three and two, they've been up and down. But have they been experienced today as Cole Corgan hits off his stick, another save. I mean, who else? If you're Wooster, you gotta be wondering where to shoot it at. One of their goals came on an empty netter. So only four have gotten past number 29 for the Bombers. That one, wide right of the net. Wooster will retain possession. Lane Kellogg closest to it. He'll scoop up the ball. Kellogg rolls the crease to his right, cuts back left, and Corgan right in his face. And Ithaca will corral it. As I've mentioned several times, Ithaca extremely efficient and clear percentage. North of 90% on the year. Happy you all were able to spend your afternoon with us. We are streaming live on Cova Sports YouTube page. Please like and subscribe. Live from the Virginia Beach Sportsplex. 13 minutes left in the fourth. Tight game. Here comes Ibrahima. The Prodigy out of Queens. 
Ooh, and a great defensive stand there. Shot, wide left. Niebuhr closest to it, Ithaca ball. 33 seconds on the clock. You gotta love the competitiveness between these two teams today. Just some pure competitive lacrosse. Started off a little sloppy, we've cleaned it up since. Niebuhr, the leading score today for the Bombers. He's got two. Here comes Ibrahima. And an Aaron pass. Proctor will chase it down. Does not cross midfield. Wooster yelling it's he's over. That is not the case. A little biased, obviously, for the Scots. Ibrahima loses it on the shot. The sophomore. Not top 10 worthy play. Wooster with it now. DeLeo will dish it out to his right. Here's Kellogg. Kellogg and DeLeo, the one-two punch for the Scots on the attack. Kellogg first on the team in points and goals and assists. DeLeo right behind him. And here comes Epstein Petrullo. He'll pass it out. That's number 25. Here's number 45. Logan Hyatt. He'll swing it to his right. Back to Epstein Petrullo. Twenty seconds on the clock for the Scots. The Fighting Scots determined to come back into this game, and they do. Tie game with 11 minutes remaining. What a shot. Wooster evens it. The bench explodes. And we're all even at six. Ithaca will take possession and they're moving fast. The defenseman will feel off, bring in the offense for the Bombers. Proctor, man, has he been running today? Burning a lot of calories. He needs a filling meal after the game. You know where he should head and where you should head. Freddy Frozen Custard and Steak Burgers. Delicious, cooked to order. Food and rich, creamy frozen custard, the best. Freddy's. Here's Niebuhr. Tie game here. Ithaca has not given up the lead. There's been three ties so far today. Sraymac, bingo! What a shot! John Sramak. Incredible. That's his 10th goal of the season. His second point today. Ithaca back on top. 10 minutes left of the fourth. They respond quickly. This is a fun one today, folks. Nick King on the call live from the Virginia Beach Sportsplex. Face off here, another ward the circle. Ground ball here, corralled by Wooster, knocked out shortly after, after a check. Both teams scrambling for it, who will get it? And it's corralled by the Scots. This game has been anything short of boring. Competitive for all 50 minutes, 10 minutes left. Wooster down one, a low scoring affair. For Wooster, one of the highest scoring teams in college lacrosse. They've been stifled by Cole Corgan today. Looking for a spark. Trying to tie it again. Ithaca's defense unrelenting. Here's Austin Jord. Jord. I mean, he's got bombers all on him. Here's DeLeo. 
the senior. He'll swing it behind the crease. Inside, and blocked by Corrigan. What a save. But Wooster unrelenting, that ball will roll out. And that's a fighting Scots possession. Turnover by the Bombers. Fresh shot clock here. Ithaca in white, Wooster in black. A little shake and bake there from Epstein Petrullo. Swings behind the crease. There's Kellogg, and he makes it tie game. Nine minutes left. Lane Kellogg, toss your hats, everybody. Three for the sophomore out of California. 31 points on the year now. And we're all even at seven. Wooster is not giving in. Keeping the pressure on defense, causing the Ithaca turnover, turns to offense seconds later. Can the Scots keep it up? Can they take the lead, their first lead? They smell it. But here comes another Ithaca. Oh, and a swap there. Ithaca won the faceoff, could not corral the ground ball. Wooster will swing it behind to his goalie Chandler. Pauly, Pauly, they say. A, a, a Scott was scorching down the right side of the field. And here's Kellogg. Can he make it four? Seven seven here. Ithaca's been a little bit quiet on offense. Only three goals in the last three periods. And an Aaron shot there to the right of the goal, but we have a whistle. He stepped inside the crease. Bomber ball. Ladies and gentlemen, do not leave your seats. Quite the matchup right now. Seven seven here in Virginia Beach at the Sportsplex. The Bombers three and two, looking for a signature win early on in their season. Students on spring break, enjoying their vacation. But these guys are at war with each other. Ithaca slowing it down. Sixty seconds on the shot clock. Seven minutes and thirty seconds left in the game. No stoppages so far this entire half. Both teams sweating it out. Proctor will spin to his right, and he's corralled immediately. That's number 40, John Allen Grind. And an Ithaca turnover, turn, Wooster possession. Seven minutes left. Can they take the lead? Wooster with an out. We have not seen much of Rory Zarin since he went down with a hand injury. But Wooster has continued to fight on the faceoff X. We, of course, hope Zarin is okay. If your young ones suffer any injuries, CHQ Sports Medicine is the place to be. Corrigan corrals another, another save. He's been quite excellent today, to say the least. Quick shot, missed, but Sraymac right there, in the possession, 60 seconds on the shot clock. We are nearing the six minute mark. Tie game, seven all. Another flyover, they can't miss this, and neither can you. Stay on your couch with us as we conclude this game. Here's a drive. 
Dishes it behind to Proctor. Proctor swings it across, that's Baker. Baker, back to Proctor. Pump fake. He'll roll the crease. Looking for an open man. He finds one. He'll bounce to his right. Shot, saved. Chandler has really stepped up following the first quarter. He's only let three through over the last near 40 minutes. And a loose ball here. Corralled by DeLeo of Wooster. Can the Scots take their first lead of the game? Here comes Epstein Petrullo. Bounced off. That's number seven. Jared Sedlock with the lockdown defense. Jordan now with the ball, pacing, taking his time. 35 on the clock. We're under five here in Virginia Beach. Quick shot, rattles off the, the iron, excuse me. Bounces high into the air and is corralled by Jord. A near laser shot, misses by inches, and that's what it's been today, a game of inches. That's why we're squared off right now at seven. Four minutes and 10 seconds left. Fresh shot clock for Wooster. The Scots seem to have all the momentum. Their offense has clicked following the conclusion of the first quarter. But Ithaca has been unrelenting. They have stood strong. Great defense there by the Bombers. Looking for a rusty gate. DeLeo, the senior, looking for a signature moment early in the season. He drives, he shoots, he misses. Over the top of the goal, Wooster possession, 15 seconds on the clock. Watch out for the cutter. There's Zarin back in the game. We have a timeout. Seems to be some confusion with the clock. Maybe not. 13 seconds on the shot clock. Kellogg drives. Kellogg, the shot saved. Cole Corrigan. The bomber's backbone keeps us even. And here come the Bombers. Dish to Proctor. Proctor, and a whistle. Timeout. Don't go anywhere. Three minutes left in the fourth. Even at seven, we'll be back right after this. Pain and Gain, your one-stop shop for all things field hockey. Located in Princess One Shopping Center, Virginia Beach, we carry everything you need on the turf, from black sticks, turf shoes, mouth guards, and much more. Try out your stick before you buy in our synthetic turf area. Pain and gain. Embrace the pain. Enjoy the game. After more than 50 years of innovation, AstroTurf still leads the way. The inventor of artificial turf does it all, right here in the USA. We engineer, test, manufacture, and install the world's most innovative fibers and turf technologies with over 30,000 tracks and fields worldwide. AstroTurf, powered by Sport Group. Treat yourself to a visit to the Drip Bar, IV hydration and vitamin therapy in Virginia Beach. Boost your immunity, increase your energy, and promote anti-aging with our personalized treatments designed to ensure efficient nutrition absorption to rejuvenate your mind and body. Come see our chic and relaxing day spa for yourself today. We welcome walk-ins and appointments. Our medical Welcome back to the Virginia Beach Sportsplex. Three minutes left in this D3 lacrosse showdown between Wooster and Ithaca, tied at seven. Today's matchup between the two squads is brought to you by The Drip Bar. And we are streaming live on Kova Sports' YouTube page. Please like and subscribe. Nick Kane on the call. Heck of a game we've had so far. Hell of a performance. 
from stars on both sides. Cole Corgan, the goalie for Ithaca, has been insane, but Lane Kellogg has been able to squeak some by him, which is even us at seven. Three minutes left. Do we see overtime today? Don't want to jinx it. Maybe not because Wooster. Oh, an Aaron turnover there. Ithaca ball. 2.38 left. Here come the Bombers. That's number 40, John Schramack. He has a point, in the, he has a goal and an assist. Two points on the day. The senior attackman has been rocks. And here comes Sam Baker. Ooh, check from behind. Wooster ball. Defensive stand by the Scots and they get the possession with two minutes left. Even at seven, Chandler the goalie. We'll start it off. Wooster, five and one on the year. Ithaca, three and two. The Bombers looking for a signature win early. Wooster looking to build on an already impressive record, trying to make it a three game win streak falling to win today. Here's Casey Steffen. The All-American last year, first, first fighting Scott to do it since 2010. And we have a turnover here. Ithaca ball and they're moving fast. Quick swing, Sramak, goal! With a minute 35 left, John Sramak, his third point of the day, second goal, puts the Bombers up eight to seven. What a shot by the senior. The leader on offense has done it again. Both him and Niebuhr, the two team leaders in goals, each have two, and they've put the Bombers up one with a buck 35 left. Five difference, five second difference separating the shot clock and game clock. Ithaca with possession, and Wooster needs a turnover here. Expect some high pressure scenarios. Could this be the signature win for the Bombers? Wooster needs to put on some pressure here. They're down one. 10 seconds separating the shot clock in game, or 20, excuse me. Baker with it. Pressure by the Fighting Scots. 44 seconds left on the shot clock. Wooster needs to make something happen here. 12 second difference between the shot clock and game clock. Why is Wooster resigning themselves? The Bombers are just running out the clock here. Wooster has not done efficiently in fast break offense today. They've done best when they slow it down. Ithaca running out the clock. Goes for the rusty gate and misses. And does that ball go out? Yes, it does. The Scots will have 22 seconds to even it up to send it to OT. Bombers need one more defensive stand. There's Cole Corrigan looking set, ready. The backbone, as I said earlier. And the pressure on. Stefan gets it up. Aaron pass. Corralled by Wooster. That's to Leo. Quick. And we have a timeout. They need to put two seconds back on that clock. Seems like a couple expired. Head coach for Wooster, Eric Seedman, making note of that. No inclination that that will happen, though. Referees corralling. They will add one more second. I personally thought it was nine, but I am not the one in the zebra outfit. Thanks for joining us here on Cova Sports' YouTube page. Nick Kane on the call. Eight seconds left. Could we have more time? Put it to 10, run it down to eight, they say. 
Expect Lane Kellogg to get the ball. He has been solid all day. He's been one of the few that can sneak it past Cole Corrigan. Can the sophomore from California make something happen? Cole Corrigan looks calm and composed as ever. He's been here before. Here comes the roll, the shot, and it's saved by who else? Cole Corrigan, one second, time expires. Ithaca wins the game, make it four and two for the Bombers. They travel down south and take the win. What a performance. The difference today was Cole Corrigan, the fifth year grad student, was incredible in the net. Ithaca held a lead all game. Wooster never held one. There were three ties. But at the end, the Bombers, who had eight first-year starters this year, come into Virginia Beach and take the win away from a veteran Wooster squad. What a game. The two squads will shake hands. Quite the war here on vacation for both teams. I'm Nick King. Thank you for tuning in to today's game, brought to you by Drip Bar on Cova Sports. Have a nice day. As a banker at Town Bank, we believe that people bank with people, not with banks. You're looking for an actual personal relationship, and that's what you get at our bank. You get that person that gets to know you, gets to know your business, is there for you. I think that is what motivates us, what drives us, and the idea that we are trying to serve others and enrich lives, I think is very true. Treat yourself to a visit to the Drip Bar, IV hydration and vitamin therapy in Virginia Beach. Boost your immunity, increase your energy, and promote anti-aging with our personalized treatments designed to ensure efficient nutrition absorption to rejuvenate your mind and body. Come see our chic and relaxing day spa for yourself today. We welcome walk-ins and appointments. Our medical professionals will help you achieve your best health and answer all your questions. The Drip Bar at Lansdowne Commons in Virginia Beach. At CHKD, sports medicine is more than just treating injuries. It's a whole team approach to caring for young athletes. With experienced physicians, surgeons, trainers, and rehab specialists here when kids and teens need them most. Our experts help young athletes prevent injuries too with advanced training and conditioning programs that keep them in the game safely. CHKD Sports Medicine, where kids are more than patients and we're more than a hospital.